Fear and threat is everywhere in, in the state. People are not ready to talk, people are not ready to speak up against injustice because they are afraid. And who are they afraid of? They are afraid of those uh, invisible hands. They are afraid of those visible soldiers, they are afraid of those visible militants and invisible people who are killing and massacring people every day. Kashmiris can't afford to fight a huge army of India. And if we have to fight, we have to fight the battle with the knowledge, wisdom, and with the non-violent means. Otherwise, we are going to lose our everything. We have lost, according to the unofficial figures, we have lost 80,000 people. That's, that, that, that's where I see that the Kashmiri secularism started. And Uh, I consider this award more uh, not as an uh, achievement for myself that I have done something. I don't think that I have done anything great. It's it's actually uh, the struggle of the people of Kashmir which gets recognized by these awards. People who have been suffering silently from last so many decades, uh, their voices were always unheard. These awards actually uh, help in um, in promoting the voices of Kashmiri people. Of those who have been killed are civilians. 40,000 children have been orphaned. In the atmosphere of human rights, we present you with the Reebok Human Rights Award. <laughs> Regarding this award, I see it as an honor for my organization, which has been trying in a humble and confined way to register, to record, resist the disproportionate use of force, war crimes and human rights violations going on against our battered nation for about last two decades. The future and secure present, it is in the interest of humankind to attend to... And I was hospitalized, I was badly injured and my right leg was amputated. Since then, I'm using this artificial leg. I think that this uh, accident, of course, has taken a lot from me. My friend, my leg, and the sense of security. But I think uh, that some of us, some of us have to dedicate our lives for the people who matter, for the people who have been suffering in Kashmir for so many years. And I think some of us have to sacrifice our time, our lives, our money. And um, I feel 
honored that I'm amongst those who who have decided to sacrifice. Ben şu oturuyor şu bas bulmuş koçu da sunda da. Yen oturuyor diye ne tekrar söyle. Bu aşağı bata koçu da söyle. They are able to create a space within civil society in a very difficult and dangerous environment for victims of human rights abuses to seek justice and for young people to talk about peaceful alternatives. <laughs> 